going to be the part of it too? Oh yeah, man, that's, it ain't no Hot Boys Tour without Turk. That's a rap on that. Like, man, it ain't no Hot Boys Tour without no Turk, man. Turk is cash money, so man, they can knock that shit off. You feel me? That, that family, regardless of how, how ever you are, you always going to have a little brother that do some crazy shit. Good. You know what it's in for, Magnolia leaving. Once again, I'm back with Video Wayne. If it ain't this here, it ain't, it ain't that real, you heard me? Stop it, stop it, y'all. Water marking us up too much. You're water whipping the game. Get your own shit and you're gonna feel your move. Now, Turk, I don't know you personally. Your brother's the one said you was a personally. They say, who is Turk? going crazy on, on Turk, bro. What, what, what's that all about? You know, it's just like the internet persona and Turk do a lot of internet stuff like, you know, he did drink chaps, the part about him and um, Wayne catching the crabs or whatever. But that's his young story with him and Wayne. Like, it is true. He says a story about him and Wayne catching the crabs. Catching the crabs or smashing the same bras and shit like that. You feel me? If it's true, that's their situation. Some people feel like that's private. That's something you should have kept in private. You feel me? I mean, so it's just the fact that maybe he put himself out there too much honesty? Yeah. Too much honesty? Or? Too much honesty. Because I didn't think nothing was wrong with the craft story. I just, yeah, but, but, but you know how people yeah. eat that shit up. Yeah. Yeah. Every concert we have, it be a success. We rock the crowd that we be looking for. You know, they won't, they won't see the hot boys. We bring them the hot boys. What we'll make motherfuckers? think that Turk not going to be a part of this tour? Just because he don't be around Stunner that much or uh, ain't in the picture with Weezy that much. Shit like that, you feel me? Pop it up. 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 You feel me? That that nigga family, regardless of how how ever you are, you always gonna have a little brother that do some crazy shit or <laughs> you gotta fight with. And you love to fight. Jizzle gonna fight. <laughs> Everybody gonna fight. You feel me? That's what it is. So and good. that's how we grew up. We, man, you you couldn't get friends in my neighborhood if you ain't have a fight. Like when you come out on the porch, you have a fight every other week. Say just shit that happens. How does the other hot boys look at her and their relationships and stuff? Oh man, it's everybody growing up. We all become men. They ain't recording together no more. Juvenile got his own catalog. BG got his own catalog. And Wayne got his own catalog. Unfortunately, due to Turk, Turk getting incarcerated and his addiction, he didn't have a long catalog. So that's why he get downplayed the most because he has the least projects. And he never put together a package where he could show his where he could shine his light you feel me because he on every hot song that dropped with cash money he either had the chorus or he had the intro to it or the first verse he had the stain like turk really out the magnolia turk really from juve court you feel me like man we really all come up together dude is really out the tc that's turk turk out the magnolia and every dj turk was there like nigga can't deny that i don't know why nigga be trying to downplay like Holmes wasn't really there. You feel me? Holmes was really out there. Birdman and uh, Turk's relationship. Birdman and Turk relationship? Um, well, it's, it's gonna always be a relationship. There, you feel me? They might don't agree with each other, but it's always gonna be a relationship. There. Like, man, you gotta literally think about when people be saying relationship, Birdman really knew us from scratch, man. Like, yeah, like since we've been little boys, you feel me? Like, man, Bird, Bird, uh, Bird, bird, the type of nigga, he gonna check you when you wrong too, you feel me? And he still gonna love you too. Like, man, we done slept in Birdman house before. Are you crazy? I'm sorry. Y'all are stupid, get off me. You said a temptation shit, but they, 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 they did the cartoons with Kurt. With yeah, yeah, you know, I think the city be playing on him too much, you feel me? Like that be shit coming from home, you feel me? Our personal vendettas and shit like that. And it's a lot of clickbaiting going on now too, you feel me? Everybody doing anything for, clicks views or whatever to get the youtube money and i think that's why i just don't you know because me and you have we was been we have been knocking out interviews but we slacked up on it because of that you feel me like i be just i don't be wanting to be on that type of time you feel me gotcha. like the negative time you feel me like or just you know with the gossip shit and or either you know or just you, you, either, say, you say kind of like become a target for people to for people to try and Get stripes off you, basically. Yeah, basically to get stripes off you, uh, clout off you, uh, get a, 
I'm good at controlling my reaction with people. So that's why you don't see a lot of shit go viral with me. You feel me? Like, cause I know I run to my comments and say some shit, but I, I'd rather comment to the people that's talking positive on my posts. And that's saying some negative shit, I ain't even responding. Cause I know you ain't from that era, you feel me? Like when I was when I was thugging and in a project, man, niggas ain't never played with a nigga like that. Man, probably wouldn't even came around. But now you got the internet, a nigga from Tuscaloosa could tell you, oh boy, when I see you, I'ma smack the bitch out you. And you know, and it's got, it's, you gotta be a strong person to be like, man, I don't even know Holmes. Like, no. But, but Turk came home and I, I, he looked good. Yeah. Like he stuck with his uh, with his decision not to, yeah. get not low. to backslide, not to get, get yeah. low more. BG just come home. What, what do you think about BG getting get loaded again? Get him being around the studio and getting that same feeling oh, of uh man. before Jeezy went to jail, Jeezy had to stop getting loaded, you feel me? So fuck mm -hmm. that's that's just a bump in the road. You know, that's that's what everybody like. You always have a bump in the road, you feel me? Some somewhere in your life you're gonna have a bump in the road. But you gotta be willing to that makes the best part of the story when you're able to go over that bump of that road and rise to the top, you feel me? Mm, come back. Look how Slim then had a slope in his career, you feel me? Slim went from no limit, then Slim had to start cut through. Mm. So, you know, that was a slump in Slim career. And look how he bounced back. He came with that, paid for it. Then he came back with Love Me or Love Me Not. And then Slim was just bubbling from there, you feel me? So we know had the No Limit tour. Yeah. The Caliper, the Cash Money tour. You see it being crazier than the Lotus? What? Okay. What's out there that could be better than a Hot Boy reunion tour? Have all them boys back together. <laughs> yeah, all with the catalogs and everything. Yeah, like, man. I don't even think you literally would have to cut like songs. Like I don't even know what would they perform. Like, cause everybody know every song. Like well, you from, got endless songs. Juby got endless songs. All niggas got hits. Yeah, hits. Yeah. Yeah, hits. Yeah. You ain't lying about that shit. How they how yeah, yeah. they got to spit them bitches into Man, Juve got take it off your shoulder, which was on the Hot Boys album. Like people know that shit, 400 Degrees, the song, not the, we ain't even talking about the whole album. Just that song is a classic itself. Yep. Niggas with that whole album. Yeah. Like you would have to literally have a, man, we ain't even talking about the big time of songs. Just think about the Too Hot remix and Papa Roo and all them songs, you feel me? Then you got the Block Is Hot songs and Lights Out songs and shit like that. Like back when Weezer wasn't cursing, like, the world and all them type of songs, you feel me? Why, but you didn't know how to walk with it. Open a name, squeeze a thing, and I see one thing in it. And try to run and bang it up. And throw it in a thing and throw it. Who doesn't know?